Welcome back guys, you are watching Brothers Together. Due to certain health issues, I wasn't able to upload any sort of videos in a few days and during that time, many people were continuously messaging me or insisting me to upload a video about my option entry story which is most probably uh, the most awaited video of this session of KCT counselling because you people have completed your document verifications, most of you and few of you are yet to complete your offline document verification which is again a major major step in your uh, counseling process which paves you a path to get into your dream college guys so during this time uh, you will be very much curious about how this option entry takes place and what are the series of events which take place as part of your option entry and what are tips and tricks which you can take from the experience which i have got by going through this particular process last year guys so in this video as i told you earlier it will be a video in which I'll be sharing the entire story of my option entry process during KCT 2022 which gave me a seat in my dream college to be sure yes guys I'll tell you everything I'm pretty sure that this video will be definitely exciting and the same way very much informative for you guys so make sure that you watch this video till the end guys and with that let me assure you that I will be coming up with videos about option entry in which I'll be discussing about what tips and tricks which you can inculcate during your option entry that will give you the best possible seat or the best possible college for your particular rank guys so for that reason make sure that you subscribe to my channel so that you will never miss out any of those with that note let's start this video guys so first things first even i went to my respective bu office for my document verification which you guys have completed most of you and some of you are yet to do it so my document verification was successfully done and after that it was followed by the downloading of the verification slip which is again a buzzword right now because you guys are yet to download your verification slip and for that reason I have already uploaded a video in which I have discussed about how your verification slip will be looking like so if you are someone who is curious about this thing then make sure that you watch it I have given it in the info card here and then after, as soon as I downloaded my verification slip I got my secret key which is a must and should in order to enter that uh, counseling portal or that option entry portal which KEA is providing in for students in order to provide their respective option. There was a release of the official circular which had come based on the mock round which will be taking place. So students were uh, insisted to register in the respective portal and through that we were able to provide options for the mock round which was set to happen so just as i talk about my story of option entry i'll be providing you detail about what are the rounds and how does it take place listen to me carefully guys first is the mock round so mock round takes place like a rehearsal kind of thing like just to provide you an idea of how things take place and how are seats allotted and things like that the same mock round took place during my option entry and in mock round I was allotted E057CS yes guys you heard it right E057CS is a computer science seat in JSS Mysore itself uh, it is an unaided seat which has a comparatively higher fees so I was just expecting the same college in the next round and talking about my list of option entry for mock round it was E021CS that is uh, SJCCS aided in the first place and then it was E057CS that is uh, JSS Mysore itself but uh, in SJC itself it was unaided seat for computer science itself and then the third one was E284 which is an extra seat which JSS STO provides. Uh, that again that also comes under this unaided category itself then I had put NIE Mysore so as a backup kind of thing I was sure that I will be getting somewhere between these three colleges itself or these three courses itself but still for as a backup listen to me as a backup I had put NIE Mysore in the bottom so NIE Mysore CS and NIE Mysore uh, IS I had put the, over there and this was the tentative or the option entry list which I submitted to KEA during the mock round and during mock round my second option which is E057CS as I already told you was allotted I was knowing the fact that the aided seat won't be allotted to me in mock round or first round but still I was expecting for that and that is what happens with us also so when we are expecting something in a later on stage we will be having a kind of little expectation for the same thing in the earlier stage itself. That was the thing which was running in my mind and after mock round results I had got E057 CS and I was calm and composed because uh, I have, I am at least getting, I was calm and composed because I was at least getting a seat in computer science in SJC Mysore which was 
my dream college and my dream course in order to pursue my engineering in so then came the first round and before first round there will be provision to change your options listen to me guys this is pretty important before the first round results come out there is no rule that your mock round options only will be uh, taken to first round and you won't have any provision to edit them you will be having the provision to edit your options before you submit them for the first round of your option entry and the first round is legitimate because the mock whatever happens in mock round is just for a practice or a rehearsal kind of thing and you won't be able to get admission to your college which gets allotted to you in the mock round so that is just a practice kind of thing and then comes the first round results then the first round results were out again i was somewhere expecting a021 cs in my mind and as soon as i upload and as soon as i uh, saw my first round result again it was a057 cs the same thing had been allotted and i was very much eagerly waiting for the second round results in which i was deeply anticipating the first option which i had entered that is an aided seat for computer science in sjc mysore and then again you will be having provision to select your choice and the options which will be there above the allotted seat in your first round you will be having provision to edit only that things and i'll be coming up with videos in which i'll be talking about in a detailed fashion about how the software works and how the software allots your seat and in the same way what things you can do after your respective mock round first round and second round so that you will get a briefer idea about how things are taking place and in this video let me keep it simple guys then the second round results were out and the second round results were out and during that time i was in a hospital since uh, my uh, close relative had injured in a road accident and during that time one of my community members one of my subscribers of this beautiful community brothers together had sent me my second round result yes guys so that was a moment which is still in mind so adding to the happiness of getting my expected seat in the second round so getting that from one of the members of this beautiful community that was a surreal moment and I have uploaded a video in which I have discussed about instant happiness which that moment gave me and how thankful I am to you people who are a part of this community since around a year right now. So with that I got my expected seat that is E021CS which is an aided seat in SJCE Mysore for computer science and through that I was kind of happy and deeply satisfied and I was just deeply elated and curious in order to get into this particular college for my engineering in which I'll be spending my next four amazing years guys. So this was the story of my uh, option entry process. I actually was thinking of going into second extended round but when I got E021 CS in second round itself I was pretty much happy and let me tell you the fact that for that particular E021 CS mine was the last rank which got uh, a seat in my category i hope you guys are preparing the tentative list for your option entry which you need to submit for your mock round which will be released very soon that is once the document verification gets over you will be getting your verification slips and kea will be releasing the circular for your mock round option entry as soon as possible and for that reason let me tell you that i will be uploading videos about each and every update which kea provides regarding your option entry and along with that i'll also be telling you that tips and tricks which you can inculcate during your option entry which will help you kind of get a seat which deserves your rank and that is what we call success in this KCT counseling guys so I enjoyed a lot while I was sharing my story of mock round first round and second round and if you did the same then make sure that you hit the like button because that will give me a lot of motivation to upload same kind of videos in the coming future and if you have any kind of doubts regarding your option entry or the counseling process for that reason then make sure that you put it in the comment section so that I'll be able to go through them and if you are someone who is participating in this KCT 2023 counseling process I would strongly recommend you to join our telegram group which is exclusively there for KCT 2023 aspirants wherein you can discuss among your peers and in the same way even I will be there to help you out over any kind of issues which you are feeling individually. With that note, this is Darshan Eskoda signing off and we are brothers together guys. Thank you guys. Thank you. We will meet in the next video. Bye.